This right here is a Polaroid Impulse IF. It has an autofocus system that works quite well in my opinion. I've only recently started shooting with it but I haven't gotten any blurry pictures from it and I think that's because of the autofocus system. To switch it on you pop up the flash. Remember that this camera, like all the other 600 type cameras, needs the film in order to work because the film has the batteries inside of it. So if you don't have film, it's not going to work. And let me show you. When you pop up the flash, you'll see a light in here. If this light is red, it means that you cannot take the picture. Once the light turns green, you can't take pictures with it. This right here is the shutter button. What I do is I press the shutter button halfway down because I think that's how the camera focuses. And then once um, I've done that, I press it all the way down to take the picture. This camera has quite a big viewfinder and it's quite nice. I think it's the nicest out of all the 600 type cameras. This camera also has a timer. Uh, it's 20 seconds, I think. And right here, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see, but there's a small square and inside there's a number. This tells you how many pictures you have left. The thing is that if you're shooting impossible project film, which probably you are, uh, the packs of film only have 8 pictures, but the camera is going to tell you that you have 10 pictures. That's because the old packs of film that Polaroid used to make had 10 pictures in them. So once you see the number 2 in here in this little square, it means that you run out, that you run out of film. To load the camera, you'll see that there's a switch right here. You go like this, and then this will pop open, and you can put the film in there. In here, you're gonna see arrows in the camera, and a switch that's to lighten and darken the, the picture, depending on the light you have and that stuff. It's a really good camera. I picked it up at a thrift store for 20 euros and it's worked quite well for me.